suppose that like growing up there was two things that were really important. Could you play football? How good you were at playing football and how, how good you were at fighting, you know? They, they were the two things where I grew up that were, current, that were important. And I never really, I suppose, fighting was never in my head. It was more, I wanted to play football and that was, that was what I was set on. And, and then maybe as I grow, grew up and start going outside my little estate and all, things start happening, maybe conflicts start happening. And I mean, I had to kind of think to myself, right, I need to be able to defend myself now as well. So I suppose I probably started off getting into it just so people would leave me alone. People wouldn't say that, you know, just say, oh, that guy does this and we leave him alone, you know. That's more like an obsession now. Everything I do is something to do with this, you know. Everything I it's always in my head. I'm always thinking about it. I'm just, yeah, I'm definitely obsessed with it. That's one thing, one thing I learned over in Iceland. But when I was training as hard as I would be back here, probably not, you know. But it's, it's in your mind, you know. It's such a, it's the mental side. Uh, that I took a lot from. I decided, like, I'm gonna do what I wanna do. If I don't wanna fucking, I don't wanna show, I don't wanna train around, I, don't, I won't train, I listen to myself. Rather than, like, showing up and killing myself in the gym every day. And I just take it, you know what I mean? Go, go with the flow, do what I feel my body needs. I'm always trying to learn, no matter what. I don't, I don't care what, 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 what your style is or whatever. I'm always trying to take something from everyone, whether you're a day one beginner or whatever you are. You know what I mean? I'm, I, I think like the day, you, the day you stop trying to learn is is the day you're getting ready to lose. You know what I mean? If you're, you're preparing to lose, then, and that's what happens to a lot of people. They get to a stage where they think, okay, I just show up and I just spar and I just run and I just roll. But I'm not trying to learn, you know what I mean? That, that was a thing I kind of uh, realised over in Iceland, you know, where I'm just showing up and going, help a letter. I was kind of just slowing it down and just really trying to learn everything and pick up off everything. And I feel my game has, uh, has elevated, definitely. Yeah, just, just be open-minded. Any style of combat, it doesn't have to be MMA, it doesn't have to be anything, you watch. Much too fucking, much too, uh, to watch the animals fighting and all, I start watching all that. Like the, the fucking the gorillas and the way they're wrestling and, and you know, the play fighting and the posture is correct and it's, they're just trying to take something from, from everything, yeah, definitely. If you ever get to a stage where you're saying, you're looking at something and saying, nah, that doesn't work, that's, my, 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 my way is better. That's the wrong way of thinking. You want to learn absolutely everything. You want to absorb everything. And you want to be perfect, you know. You're looking for perfection. And you're looking to be able to move every way. And, you know, that's, that's what I'm looking for anyway, you know. I've been listening, I've been listening to laughter all my career. Yeah. I've been listening to them laugh my whole career. They've been laughing. What? An Irish man win a win a Cage Warriors world title? Hell no. You serious? An Irish man? An Irish man win a fight in the UFC? Hell no. Laugh. Laughs all around. An Irish okay, you gotta win. Now he wants to win a world title? Hell no, he's all talk, he's all hype, he's a joke. Laughter all around at the Joker. Then the joking, I bet I don't know, mate. The sound of laughter and the sound of doubt motivates me. So I'm I'm enjoying that. I seek that. I don't feel no doubt or, or, or I don't feel no, I don't feel that going to fight in any of these other UFC bombs right now. They need to rise up. Right now they're, they're down there. I've got this situation where people are truly doubting me like they doubted me at the very, very beginning. And that's motivating for me. That's what's going to drive me to the gym when I need to go to the gym and to put in that work to get that win. So that's where we're at right now.